What's up guys, it's Kiyomi here, and welcome to a new series we're going to be calling The Weirdest Ads on Craigslist. So, if you don't know what this series is all about, you probably don't because it's a new series, but yeah, we're basically just going to be going over some of the weirdest ads that I can find on the site Craigslist. And if you don't know Craigslist, it's actually a site where you can post any ads you want, and there are tons of different sections for different things, such as, I'm going to read some off. Some of the sections include community, housing, jobs, for sale, services, gigs, resumes, discussion forums, and personals. What are personals? I wonder what I'm I wonder what I wonder what those are. Who knows? Maybe we'll find out today. But yeah, let's get right into this video. Okay, so first we're going to be going into, uh, let's go start off strong and let's go into the personal section because I find a lot of weird shit in there. So let's go to women seeking men. Men, okay, women seeking men. Let's see what women are seeking here. Let's see what these women are seeking. Okay, so lots of random things. So people are looking for dates. Geeky girl looking for geeky guy. Curvy woman. LTR. What's LTR? What's, what's LTR? Oh, you know what? I think it stands for a long-term relationship. Let's, let's find something with a funny headline and then we'll click on that one. That's what you really gotta you really gotta be eye-catching with these headlines. BBW needs you. What's a BBW? What's a let's a, let's take another definition check and go to BBW. What does BBW mean? Oh shit! It's porn. Don't go to that shit. Don't do it. Okay, we're on Urban Dictionary now. Let's see what let's see what it means. A lady who's on the large side of things yet still sexy. Oh, so it's like a fat person. Okay, so I just found this weird ad. 36 years old, Seattle. Soccer jocks, let me worship your cleats. Let's read what this ad's all about. I'm looking for soccer jocks under 30 who will make me clean and worship their dirty cleats. Okay, so dude, I'm done. This is weird. I am not looking for anything sexual. Basically, I want you to make me get on your knees, on my knees, and worship you and your cleats. Make me pay you for the honor of kissing your cleat. If I wear your uniform, I would pay even more. Okay, that's really fucked up. I just, I don't understand. Like, why would someone want to pay to wear someone's cleats? You gotta be like... You gotta be fucking crazy to be this person. That is one of the weirdest ads I've ever seen. I don't know what to say, guys. That's really weird. If you want to go worship this person's cleats, just go on this ad and contact this girl... She's 36 and ready to lick the dirt off your cleats. One says accepting applications for boyfriend position. Dot dot dot. LOL. Maybe we can submit our application today. Hey, my apologies, but I'm currently out of applications. So if you could please submit a copy of your resume. Dot 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 dot. LOL. My info. I have HSV1. Human syphilis vaccinated one maybe you're vaccinated for syphilis maybe i don't know but i'm single and have kids i'm in my early 40s bbw for fwb i don't know what fwb is so let's so let's search this up friends with ba oh so i'm learning all these terms today it's kind of like all this information going to my head i'm learning all the shit okay so let's read this bbw for fwb finally read it properly Left the love of my life several months ago, as he was incapable of being in a relationship. I have no desire to take on any relationship. My job and other responsibilities has kept me busy. You're boring, you already lost my interest. Go kill yourself. Okay, I found another one. This is all one word, guys. This is all one word. Disabled BBW cancer patient seeks new man. Oh my fucking god, that's gotta be the ugliest person I've ever seen. Holy shit. Oh my god, dude. No offense. Okay, no offense. I'm not trying to be rude. I'm not trying to roast y'all. I'm just saying you're ugly as fuck. Like, no offense. I'm not trying to roast. I'm not trying to be rude. But this person has got to be one of the ugliest persons I've ever seen. But who knows? Maybe, maybe she has the best personality you've ever seen. Likes movies, music, and crafts, and animal. I mean, who doesn't like those things? It's not like you're basic or anything. You're a normal ass person. You're just kind of fucking ugly, dude. I'm sorry. This person says no clickbait. So, I mean, we gotta click it. Like, we gotta click it, man. We gotta click it. Decided to take a diff approach. No flashy photos or provocative subject lines. I'm just a girl standing in front of the internet. Standing in front of the... 
Is Are you straight up like, where's the internet? Is there like a place where the internet is? I don't understand. I'm inclined to wait a bit of time before we exchange photos. I want to undress your mind, man. No thanks, that was a boring as fuck. No one knows how to write a proper bio here, they all suck. 420, Netflix and chill. I'm all down for that. Smoke weed every day. So basically this bitch just writes a huge ass bio. I don't even want to read it. Understand I have a kid. Okay, you have a kid by Pokemon Go date or Suicide Squad date. You want to play Pokemon Go? You love movies? I mean, who doesn't play Pokemon Go and who doesn't love a good movie? I mean, I'm not a big fan of movies, but... Okay, I think that's enough shitty Craigslist ads for today. Everyone sucks at writing bios, that's what we know from this series so far. I'm hoping to do a lot more of these, these are really fun to read. It's funny to just see what the people have to write. So yeah, anyways guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, please hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Bye.